People of all races and colors can develop skin cancer. Although people of color have a lower risk of developing skin cancer than Caucasians, when skin cancer develops in people of color, it is often diagnosed at a more advanced stage, making it more difficult to treat. To protect your skin and reduce your risk of skin cancer, dermatologists recommend that everyone, including people of color, take the following steps. Seek shade whenever possible. Remember that the sun's rays are strongest between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Wear sun protective clothing, such as a lightweight, long-sleeved shirt and pants, as well as a wide-brimmed hat and sunglasses with UV protection. Apply sunscreen before going outdoors. Apply it to all exposed areas of the skin, including your scalp, ears, neck, and lips, about 15 minutes before going outside. Use a broad-spectrum, water-resistant sunscreen with an SPF of 30 or higher. Remember to reapply your sunscreen every two hours or immediately after swimming or sweating. When skin cancer is diagnosed in people of color, it is often found in areas of the skin that are not typically exposed to the sun. For example, the bottom of the foot is where 30 to 40 percent of melanomas are diagnosed in people of color. When detected early, skin cancer is highly treatable. To help detect skin cancer, dermatologists recommend that people of color do the following. Learn the A, B, C, D, E's of melanoma. A is for symmetry. One half of the spot is unlike the other half. B is for border. The spot has an irregular, scalloped, or poorly defined border. C is for color. The spot has varying colors from one area to the next, such as shades of tan, brown, or black, or areas of white, red, or blue. D is for diameter. While melanomas are usually greater than six millimeters or about the size of a pencil eraser, when diagnosed, they can be smaller. E is for evolving. A mole or spot on your skin that looks different from the rest or is changing in size, shape, or color. Even if you don't notice any other symptoms, see a board-certified dermatologist if you notice an existing mole start to evolve or change in any way. In addition, new spots or moles that itch, bleed, or change color are often early warning signs of skin cancer. Check your skin regularly. Pay particular attention to your mouth, the palms of your hands and fingernails, groin, buttocks, and the soles of your feet and toenails. Ask a partner to help. Another set of eyes can be helpful for checking the back and other hard-to-see areas. Skin cancer can look and develop differently in individuals with skin of color than it does in individuals with lighter skin. That's why it's so important for everyone to check their skin regularly and make an appointment to see a board-certified dermatologist if you see anything unusual. To learn more about skin cancer or find a dermatologist in your area, visit aad.org.